So welcome back. Uh, this is also a very typical question which involves a mean mode median, and in this case just a mean, where it says, well, the weights of five people, yeah, or the weight of five people, are 82 kilos, 78, 86, 87, and 79 kilograms. Okay, but then a new person joins the group, yeah, and the mean weight now goes up with a kilo. What is the weight of that new person? Yeah, so I have five people, number six comes, what is his or her weight? Okay, um, yeah, it's always a little bit difficult. And where do you start? Yeah, and some people uh, stop there already because they're like, well, I've, I've, I've never done this. I know I have to calculate the mean, but they're not asking me to calculate the mean. They're asking me what is the, what, what is, what is, what is the weight of that new person? But never focus on the things you don't know. Let's focus on the things you do know. Because I just said, I know how to calculate the mean. Well, let's do that. Let's just start there and see where that ship leads us to, yeah? Because the mean is 82 plus 78 plus 86 plus 87 plus 79, yeah? the sum of all the values, divided by the amount of values. And those are five people, okay? So I can calculate the mean and it's gonna give me points, yeah? So we like points and the examiner likes to give you points. So let's work together and do that 79 equals of course we have to show as much workings as we can 412 over 5 and divide that by 5 is 82.4 all right so the mean in the first situation with those five people is 82.4 kilograms yeah but now i have another person joining yeah so i could say mean old if you like mean new because what is happening the mean is going up with one kilogram okay that's interesting because the mean is the sum of all the values divided by the amount of values now what is the sum of all the values in the new situation well that is 82 plus 78 plus 86 plus 87 plus 79 plus what can i call that x uh, the weight of that new person, divided by how many people do I have? Six. Okay, and how much is that mean, the new mean? Well, it's one kilo more than the old mean. And that one was 82.4, so the mean in the new situation is going to be 83.4 kilograms. Okay, that all together was 412, and we're gonna put it in my calculator again, plus X divided by six. And I have this beautiful algebraic equation, yeah, which I can solve now. Because if I times both sides by six, yeah, I can say that 412 plus x, and I'm very lazy now, I'm, I, I do apologize. Uh, it's been a very long day. Times six is 504. And then if I take away 412 on both sides, I say that x take away 412 equals 88.4. So this guy is, if I just do that here, 88.4 kilograms. Now always, with every question and every answer, of course, you check does that make sense? Yeah? If I get a weight of 8,844 kilograms, that wouldn't really make sense, would it? Yeah. But 88.4 kilograms, well, that is a weight that I trust. Secondly, if the mean goes up, yeah, that means that the weight of this new person has to be more than the old mean. Again, if the mean is going up, then the weight of this new person has to be larger than that mean. And indeed it is, but it's still a weight that somebody can have. Uh, it's not completely acceptable, it's not too heavy or anything like that, okay? So it's a very typical question again involving me, and where you uh, are also asked to show your understanding of algebra uh, and, that you, um, and that you are able to tell yourself rather than to panic, but just to tell yourself to be calm and to write down the things you do know, yeah? Let's calculate the mean. Oh, hang on a minute, plus one in the new situation and you construct this equation and you get these points one by one. All right, that was that. Uh, next video is gonna be about the mean in grouped frequency tables. I'll see you there.